Welcome to Vlogmas, day 15. So today we are going to be following my best friend around for her business. Um, she's going to be a vendor for the holiday season. So I want to show you guys kind of what goes into this whole crazy holiday season as a vendor. So if you're one of the homies, thanks for returning. Welcome back. And if you're not, please go ahead and subscribe so we can be homies. You're following us to two vendor events today. The thing about being a vendor is that the night before requires a lot of preparation to make sure that things go seamlessly for the next day, especially if you're expecting a large turnout. Because we were so prepared and had everything folded and worked as a team, she was able to work on introducing some new products and was also able to work on more creative endeavors that she could introduce to her audience. This was actually her first time ever working with a multi-layer design where she had to apply a ribbon in between the words. She was super excited and she actually did a great job, no surprise there. day as a vendor also does hinge on having good help family friends whoever you can get to come and assist you of course this is my best friend so I definitely made myself available to stuff buttons in bags just give them you know something to drink something to eat but make sure you have people around you that truly support you with nothing to gain This was also her first time introducing cups to her audience. Um, with it being the Christmas and holiday season, people are looking for gifts for others. And a lot of times if you have more variety, they're more willing to stop at your table. So it's great that she had the time to be able to focus on having a variety of products. Stamp of approval. It's going good, real good. 
and got ordered. Met some great people. I was real excited and anxious because I didn't know what to expect. Um, but so far, so good. <laughs> My business is IMF LLC. I created this um, during a dark time in my life where I was seeking and searching for validation from everyone else. But God showed me that he was the only one that needed to validate me. I have shirts that says, I am enough, pray, hustle, repeat. Um, I recently lost a cousin due to domestic violence. And so I'm starting a foundation in honor of her. And so having the proceeds from the shirts will go towards that foundation. Thank you. Awesome. How do you feel about this event that we just wrapped up? I feel like it was a huge success. I saw a lot, but I met a lot of people, connected with a lot, and I was able to share the message and just be able to give back and just gave away some free items. So you heard that. So if you want free stuff, you're supposed to come to the pop-up events. That's what happens. You come to pop-up events, you linger, you might get free stuff. You know? It's math. It's math. Come to the next event and you'll see. I wasn't expecting anything, but just to be in have an impact on those that I was supposed to impact. Yeah. So the goal was achieved. Yes, it was. Exceedingly <laughs> so. and abundantly. <laughs> well, <laughs> sorry. So where are we going now? To my second event at Amaze Productions. Um, it's at the Northland Performing Arts Center. It's about to be lit. It's about to be super lit. So yeah. Headed to the next one, and we will see you there. currently at the second event this event looks very exciting there's gonna be i don't know people doing tricks from the ceiling i don't know what's going on at this event but it looks pretty lit like there's people with crazy outfits on and i'm just super excited and ready so the kiddos here they have a business and they are selling merch you see them over there so cute I love the little entrepreneurs. Support them. I'm gonna drop the link down in the description, okay? Support them. For now, we're just waiting. I'm getting to rest a little bit and edit some more footage for you guys. So keep watching.
financially spiritually and mentally and just being able to actually be a blessing to someone without expecting anything in return like i came into this expecting connections not just finances and both have been provided exceedingly you think you always have to receive something instead of just giving the mission for i'm enough is bigger than me and it's not just about the clothing it's about instilling in people that they are enough that they do have somebody that's rooting for them you got to see it rooting for you right here. Breaking my breaking my equipment. Breaking my equipment. What you got to say for yourself? <laughs> oh, you offer me popcorn? Is this payment for breaking my equipment? Oh. It went really good. Really good. Really good? Yes. Did you enjoy talking to the people here? Yes, I enjoyed talking to the people. I um, actually gave a lady some much too she was walking by and god told me to give her a button we talked tomorrow gave her a shirt and yeah almost had a little cry about over here so i told y'all she'd be giving away free stuff i told y'all told y'all and y'all act like y'all want to support if you just show up you might get some you never know it's like an emotional experience for you hi with your business yes it's it's my baby and it's being able to share what god gave me to others is just yeah it's a little it's a touch a little tender part of my heart <laughs> okay homies i hope y'all had fun watching um some of what it takes to be a vendor during the holidays yes. if you have more questions about that you can definitely reach out to sid for i am enough is i am enough movement and then also lina wall co yeah so check her out she's been doing a lot of holiday pop-up shops and if you need any advice or like i said she'd be giving away that free stuff you see that wink <laughs> i'm working on it still. yeah i'm working <laughs> But yeah, I mean, what did you think your overall experience like? Is it crazier during the holidays? It is crazier, but it's also more rewarding. You actually have people that are seeking to buy things. And so it gives you an opportunity to speak to them and connect with them and also like personalize items as well. I hope you guys enjoyed. If so, make sure that you hit that like button so that I know you like content like this. Subscribe to. And subscribe so you can be a homie. Mama, your aunties, your uncles. Yeah, cousins, all <laughs> of them. So it's been real homies. We'll catch you in the next one.